Hello everyone, today we're going to be building a lean-to pallet structure. The first thing you're going to want to do is get all your materials such as 18 to 20 48 inch pallets, 7 8 foot landscaping timbers, 8 8 foot 2x4s, 4 sheets of metal roofing, 2 10 foot 2x6s, a 1 pound box of 3 inch decking screws, a box of roofing screws and a drill. Now you're done with all that, you're going to want to get three pallets and line them up on the back. And then at each end, you're going to want to put one landscaping timber. Now you're going to attach two pallets to the side, and you're going to put one landscaping timber in the front of the pallet. And you're going to repeat on that side. For the front, you're going to want to do something a little bit different. So you're going to want to put one pallet on either side with a timber, leaving a hole in the middle for a door. Now in the back of the building, you're going to want to get your final landscaping timber and put it in the middle of the pallet. Then you're going to want to cut a pallet in half, put one piece of the pallet on either side, leaving the middle open to make a window, and then connect your 2x6s on the front and back of the building on the landscaping timbers. Now after doing that, cut your landscaping timbers at a 45 degree angle, then go to the one on the sides, get two pallets, cut them to fit in with a 45 degree angle, and then go to the other side and do the same thing. Now at each end of the building, you're going to want to put one 2x4 and then space out the remaining six across the top of the building evenly. And now you're going to want to start putting the sheet metal on the roof, making sure each piece of sheet metal overlaps by one rib. And then across where the 2x4s are, you're going to want to put four sheet metal screws. Now you need to add siding. We chose vinyl, but you can choose any type. And you can add a door or not, it's up to you. So now let me tell you a story of why we ended up building the structure. So basically, we um, had this metal, like tin structure, goes was in before. It's from like Home Depot. Was. I don't exactly remember what, but it wasn't particularly good. They would be able to bend it by kicking it and stuff like that. Then we was like, oh well, uh, what would be the best idea as an alternative? So, so I was searching on sites and stuff like that. We saw an idea on pictures. It was like, oh. Use pallets as the building structure. We're like, oh, that's a pretty good idea. So we started looking around for pallets and all that stuff and how we could design this building. So now I'm basically going to tell you how we ended up designing it. It was mostly just around what we actually had because we had the roofing, we had the 2x4s, and we had a general idea of where to get pallets. So it's pretty easy for us to get all this stuff. So we got all our pallets and local bits, just give them away, didn't even have to pay for them. So it's like, it's like, well, then we decided, well, the pallets wasn't very structurally, like, sound and all that stuff in a building. You needed a bit more support. That's when we ended up getting the landscaping timbers. And then we realized the landscaping timbers actually fit pretty good inside of the pallets. That's when we got the idea to basically put the landscaping timbers in the pallets and then screw them all together. Rather than just, like, putting them outside or something like that. So now I'm going to tell you how much it costs us to build it. See, since we had the majority of this stuff for free, we didn't have to pay for it. It only cost us about $75 for like the random stuff we didn't have to get. But for you, as a person just wanting to build this by yourself, it would cost somewhere between $150 to $200. So, that's about all. If you like this video, like, subscribe, and comment how yours turned out, and see you later.